A glittering and meaningful occasion. And all week long, the football chatter has centered around this game and these talented teams. Which one will outwit the other in a stadium both packed and passionate? So many questions to be answered on a day of destiny. We're live on EA TV. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Nottingham Forest versus Arsenal. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And here's how Nottingham Forest will line up. Well, they're going to play with two wingers here, but I'm just a little bit worried that the centre forward could become isolated. Therefore, the midfield players need to get forward as much as possible in this 4-3-3 shape. Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reactions from the goalkeeper that was. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts alongside Declan. There it is! The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, this deserves another look. Just see the bend he gets on the ball. That's a great bit of skill and an excellent goal. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Chris Wood. Beautifully weighted ball. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Chance for the leveller. Can they put it away? It has to be, surely. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Crossing opportunity. Can they slot at home? Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Harry Toffolo. It's with Aurel Mongala. Ibrahim Songare. And it's with Gibbs White. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Is this the moment? Chance here. Full credit. Wonderful stop. Jesus. Now Zinchenko, Martinelli, and a chance, Erdogan, able to clear the danger, at least for now. Firing it towards goal, he's blocked it. Well, they have it again, and the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Mongala. Wood. He'll try his luck here. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position.
Not the best free kick we'll see today. Well off target. Well, not really what he was looking for there. That's a waste of a good situation. Declan Rice. Now well, the pass not finding its target. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Here's Chris Wood. A goal! Real excitement. A back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Alexander Zinchenko. Partey. Martinelli. And here's Partey. And can they prize them open now? Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Dominguez. Murillo Toffolo Ibrahim Songare Chris Wood Now let's see what they can do here But they dealt with the threat posed Well the halftime whistle fast approaching It's Arsenal with the lead Stuart, interested to get your thoughts on their performance so far yeah, it's certainly been an open game, but on the balance of play, I think they do deserve their lead. They just have that little bit more creativity, particularly in the wide areas. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Toffolo, and out of play it goes, alas. William Saliba. Now Zinchenko. Well, they're a bit like a passing machine, and you can understand why they want to play it that way in front as they are. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Alexander Zinchenko. Partey. Rice with it. Now Zinchenko. Thomas Partey. They really look after the ball when they have it. Partey. Gabriel Jesus. Rice. Determined defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Danger still on. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. 
Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately, that can't be said about the rest of the team, who need to improve if they're going to turn this around. So the two teams have switched around, and the second half is underway. Ibrahim Songare and Chris Wood good strength to keep the ball a oh, very effective play and they might be onto something the referees letting it go as they keep the ball and fine work from Arsenal to win it back lots of space for Arsenal Looking for a teammate. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Songare. Toffolo. Very quick thinking there. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Partey. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Chris Wood. It's with Aurel Mongala. Well, he's beaten his opponent. He has time to play it over. This could be the equaliser. But oh! Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Well, as you can see, it's an error from the goalkeeper. You just can't spill it into a dangerous area like that. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. And support available. They were playing fluent football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. Well, the referee has taken note of his name and number. Well, I think he can count himself a bit unlucky there, but it was certainly a foul. Into the box it goes. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Thomas Partey. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Defence the Brazilians to shut them down. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Well, the possession tells you everything. Nothing really to split between the two sides. It's been an enthralling encounter up to now, with both teams playing some really good expansive football. You just wonder if the coach would be looking at that and how they can tighten up at the back, as it's been chance after chance right now. Effective work from Arsenal to regain possession. Jesus. Arsenal could be onto something. And options in the centre. 
Good piece of defending. Mongala. Chris Wood. It's Callum Hudson Odoi. Can they take the lead here? With the game level, let's see what they can do with this corner. Well, they've decided to make a change. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Over it comes. Any goalkeeper would accept corner kick deliveries like that every day. A quarter of an hour remaining here. In with a chance. And a stinging shot, but off target. Well, as you said, off target when really that should be hitting the back of the net. That's a golden opportunity. Time for a change then. And the ball with Boli. Ibrahim Songare. Hudson Odoi. Must take the lead here. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Can they forge ahead? Reading it well. Well, they have the ball once more. Alexander Zinchenko. And if you've already received a yellow card, you surely want to stay away from that sort of challenge. And it has been deemed a second bookable offence. His day is done, Stuart. And if I was the coach, I'd have taken him off earlier. This always looked likely to happen. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Five minutes of the 90 still to go. And the teams cannot be separated. Alexander Zinchenko. It's with Gabriel. And with the teams locked together, Arsenal chasing and chasing that winner. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Well, it looked so promising, but it all comes to nothing. Oh, nice ball over the top. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Willy Bolli. It's with Aurel Mongala. A very effective challenge put in. He's in with a chance. With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. And the referee blows his whistle. Now we can say it officially, Arsenal have won this game. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. Well, a leading and guiding role played by Martin Odegaard. Sensational performance on all levels. Stuart, your assessment of his production? Well, he's the match winner, and deservedly so. He was outstanding today. He's great to watch when he's in this sort of form.